Hey YouTube, it's Sean. And um got this little uh, Weller soldering iron. And um discovered uh, real quickly um as much as I use this thing is uh it's getting real expensive to buy tips for it. You now it just takes the little disposable crappy little tips that you can buy. But uh problem with them are is these tips these little tips it's eight bucks for two of these guys it's four bucks for one of these tips and they don't last that long I found these burn up like really fast so I discovered uh, I'm gonna try this and if I ruin the soldering iron oh well um, next summer I'll brought buy another one at a yard sale and I think I have like two or three more of these but um, I'm making my own out of this uh, real heavy copper wire. It's just, uh, um, I think it's a number six. Mm, no, it's a number eight. I can't remember. Let me see. Uh, they had six and they had eight at the hardware store. And I was looking for 10 gauge, but they didn't have it. So I think this is probably eight. This is probably 8 gauge because um, the bigger the number, the smaller the wire. So, yeah, this is probably 8. Either way, um, I bent me up a tip. And um, this whole, uh, I think, 2 feet of it was uh, $2.20. And you can make a lot of tips with 2 feet of wire. And um, this stuff is thick. Oh, boy. So, um, I bent me up a tip. And I'm going to grind the end a little more and get it right to where I want it. These are way heavier than um, than these. Um, you can see the comparison. You know, the little square, junky. And then they got this heavy stuff that I got at the hardware store. And underneath this, shiny metal is just copper. You know, you can grind away the end of it and it's just copper and they coat it with uh they tin it pre-tin it with uh solder for you the whole thing's just covered with a little thin coat of solder which is bs you really don't need that all you need is just bare copper and i'm gonna go with some heavy heavy gauge and watch let's see if it lasts longer um the first thing i gotta do though is i found me a drill bit and i um the holes in the soldering iron excuse me to even getting a little close there I need to be drilled out just a little bit to accept this heavier wire but I bet you this works way better and I bet you I get longer life out of a tip those tips let's give it a shot and I'll, I'll bring you back and show you how it works if if it works well, I might not show you how it works just let you know if it worked but um it's a it's an experiment. I'm gonna try it. Catch you later, guys. Bye.